Hello guys and welcome to another episode of MCK Auto Bulbs. I'm gonna try and explain to you today the uh, differences between uh, amber indicator bulbs PY21W namely and we're gonna do it by doing like a case study of a car I have uh, for a couple days now. It's a Nissan Qashqai 2018 model and I had replace the uh, indicators which go in the in the rear there you can see other videos how to do it but basically what I wanted to explain to you is the differences between some of them bulbs which I'm gonna show you as well up close can you, you can see them so basically the smallest one we have is a new style we have new type we've got which has a current of 550 milliampere which I hoped will work fine on the car but unfortunately it doesn't so the car still was throwing up error that the bulbs don't work and obviously flashing fast as well uh, so then I installed the the biggest we have the strongest we have which are 2.7 amp which is five times as much as the uh, the small one the smaller one and work perfectly fine with them. They're very bright. They're our uh, the most expensive bulbs because of the uh, the canvas uh, circus basically inside them. Uh, they're very bright and they are big, so you just need to be careful uh, if you've got space, you know, to slide them in. Basically, in Nissan Qashqai, there was enough space for that. But then uh, I put the mid-range. Let's say I have this one as well, which is 1.7 amp, which is only three times as much as the, uh, the small one and it still worked fine still ultra bright these bulbs are very bright very nice very strong and they work fine so basically the idea is that the, each car has its canvas current running through the uh, system and depending on that current uh, you have to install the bulbs that can be higher than that current running through them so they don't trip the computer basically so these bulbs were 550 milliamp or half an amp basically they work perfectly fine in most bmws in most audis uh, there are some exceptions though that's why it's so important you know to find it we are trying basically to uh, list every bulb and try to you know when we are releasing a new bulb try to uh, just release it to a certain car certain model that we are sure that uh, They work fine, you know, and then build that build from there basically the list of compatibility so uh, You don't buy something and then have to send it back, you know, but please please do understand that this is a complicated thing and uh, depends on the car and really uh, Sometimes even in some car there are some modifications. So the uh, the uh, the computer still throws up error so it's a bit tricky you know in every case but like in this case study for the cash guy the boobs that work fine in other cars uh, don't work they throw up error they blink fast then you know got the other ones and if you want to go for the top of the range the brightest ones the uh, the, the strongest ones you can you can do as well we'll have a link to description to all of them and hope you can understand you know the the main thing when you're searching for it is that canvas but canvas doesn't mean it will work on all cars canvas is not universal it depends on the car and you really need to you know uh, try to make sure uh, we're trying to make sure with every car but like i said we're not always 100 percent right so uh, please you know don't give us negative feedback or <laughs> bad comments just contact us we'll sort it out definitely and uh, find the best solution for you. So thank you guys for watching and I'm gonna show you in a second as well the differences between them and when they are uh, Connected as well. Basically these two are the strongest just because they work only as indicators and As you can see in the video they just light up for one second and then they go dimmer because the circuit inside cannot hold it longer because they will simply burn uh, the circuit inside so that's why they have to you know work only for a second and then 
go basically very dim which is very good for indicators but obviously uh, wouldn't work for reverse lights or brake lights you know because of that uh, but they are very good for the indicators so thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed it see you in the next video